friends. Welcome back to Unite Coaching. In this tutorial, we are going to learn the process of estimating the quantity of cement and sand for the damp proofing course in Microsoft Excel. As you can see here, I have already made the steps in Excel and I have calculated the quantity of material. I will explain you it in detail. Let us consider the proportion of mortar as 1 is to 2, where 1 is cement, and 2 is sand. I have considered area of DPC as 80 square meters, and thickness of DPC as 20 millimeters. Therefore, wet volume of mod required will be, area into thickness of plaster. To calculate it in Microsoft Excel, put formula as, is equals to this area, which is cell C4 into thickness, which is cell C5 divided by 1000. This divide by 1000 is because the thickness of DPC we have taken is in millimeters, but it has to be taken in meters. Now, this volume of DPC is increased 33% more. Therefore, formula in Excel will be is equals to volume of damp proof course which is the cell C6 into 1.33. This 1.33 is taken, because, volume of DPC is increased 33%. Dry volume of mortar comes to be 2.128 cubic meters. The next step is to calculate the quantity of cement required. The formula is dry volume, divided by the sum of proportion, into proportion of cement. That is, this 2.128 divided by 1 plus 2, into 1. To calculate it in Excel, put Excel formula as, is equal to, bracket, cell C7, divided by, bracket start, cell C3, plus D3, bracket close, into cell C3, and at last, again bracket close, which comes to be 0 0.7093 cubic meter. Now, Calculate number of bags of cement required. We know that the volume of one bag of 50 kg cement bag is 0.035 cubic meter. Therefore, use formula as is equal to round up double bracket cell C9 divided by 0.035 bracket close, comma, 0 bracket close. As I have said in my previous video of concrete quantity. The roundup formula is because the cement bags cannot be taken into points. Therefore, to round up that value to next round figure, we use this roundup formula. Now, to calculate the quantity of sand required, the formula is dry volume divided by the sum of proportion into proportion of sand. That is, this 2.128 divided by 1 plus 2 into 2. To calculate it in Excel, put Excel formula as, is equal to, cell C7, divided by, bracket start, cell C3, plus D3, bracket close, multiplied by cell D3, again bracket close, which comes to be 1.419 cubic meter. We know that, 1 cubic meter is equal to 0 0.354 brass. Therefore, to calculate the quantity of sand in brass, use formula as, is equal to, bracket start, cell C11, into 0 0.354, bracket close, which is equal to 0 0.502 brass. Now, we will calculate the cost of materials. For that, prepare a table like this. Serial number, description, quantity, unit, rate, and total cost. Directly give the formula for quantity. For cement bags, the value will be equal to the cell C10. Therefore, put formula as is equal to C10. Similarly, put the formula for sand as is equal to cell C11. Units will also be same. I have taken the rate of one bag of cement as 350 rupees and rate of sand as 1000 rupees per cubic meter. So, to calculate the total cost, just put formula as quantity multiplied by its rate. For total cost of cement bags, put it as, is equal to cell C16 into E60, 
which comes to be 7350 rupees similarly calculate total cost of sand by multiplying its quantity with rate which will be is equals to cell c17 into cell e17 which comes to be 1418.67 rupees the last part is to calculate total cost of materials for that put a formula as is equal to sum bracket start cell f16 is to cell f17 which comes to be rupees 8768.67 round it next number by clicking here you can also take the quantity of waterproofing agents as 1 kg per bag of cement and rate may be taken in between 30 rupees to 100 rupees depending upon the type of waterproofing agent in this way you can calculate the quantity and cost of cement and sand required for the damp proof course thanks for watching this tutorial please like share and subscribe to this channel for such videos if you have any questions regarding this video please feel free to ask and comment your doubts in the comment section below thank you